Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Witch and 100 Night Revival Edition. Lord player and today, yeah, we're going to continue on from where we left off. Where Natalia got ridiculed by Yeah, the Walpurgis witches. And yeah, it seems like it hit, hit her pretty hard. So let's see what happens now as what she will do. Quite brutal, that. How is she, Arlecchino? Still refusing to come out? Yes, I brought her a delicious meal. But she said nothing to me in return. I left it in front of her door, so I do hope she eats it, but... Master... Will she be okay? Master Leah was very unlike herself. Uh, more excited than usual about this particular event. And it turned out like that. Maybe we should leave her alone until she calms down. Master... Ah, yes, Master Visco. Were you able to discern the voice of the witch who cursed you? I knew it! Visco's form is due to a witch's nasty curse! How did it happen to you anyway? I'm sure I felt the presence of the witch who cursed me, but... But who was it? I'm not sure. But perhaps it was that one. Or maybe... Um, Visco? Oh, oh, sorry. I was lost in thought. As for why I was cursed, I'm afraid your guess is as good as mine. People often told me that my work as an Inquisitor was like karma, that it'd result in receiving a witch's rage. And then one morning, I woke up and saw that I had changed into this. But when I heard the witch's voices on Mount Asbrock, and I felt something. What did you feel? Um, this go. You wouldn't happen to be a witch yourself, would you? Uh, of course not! There's no way I'd ever want to be an evil, selfish thing like a witch! Uh, I'm sorry! That's not what I meant! Oh, right. My apologies. Honestly, when I was little, I looked up to my teacher who was a witch. But that's different. Anyway... Can't we think of a way to get into the Walpurgis party? I know what Metallia wants, but this is also about finding clues to lift my curse. I won't give up that easily. Lucini, don't you have, like, star-guided information or something? You know, about the party? N no I don't know anything. If I did, I'd have gone right away. I... I see. If it were possible to go, then maybe my master would come out of her room. Hmm. It is inevitable, then. We will have to borrow her powers. Her? Who are you referring to? The Great Forest Witch, Maria. Act 2, Chapter 6. The Witch and the Big Soiree. Yeah, he said that so casually as well. The forest Witch? She's alive? But I thought that Metalia... Master Malia is still alive, yes. The fact that I have not ceased to function is compelling evidence. Ceased to function? You? Beyond the garden where Sir Hundred Knight faced Master Malia, there is a place called Hekahene Forest. If you enter those hidden woods, there may be something left to discover in its depths. Yes. Yeah. Huh. Sounds like we have to fill in the details ourselves. What? So she didn't actually kill the Forest Witch. I see. Regardless, will the Forest Witch extend Metallia an invitation to the party? It is uncertain. But if it is for Master Leah's happiness, I am certain she will provide some sort of aid. Master Malia was once in charge of the nighttime soiree, you see. 
There is nobody better suited to extend an invitation than her. But Hekahene Forest is a wild forest under Master Malia's most profound protection. Many fierce magic beasts live there. If possible, I believe that Sir Hundred Knight is best suited to go. The rest of us should remain here and oversee Master Leah's condition. How very true! I'll do my best! Yes, that makes sense. But who's gonna help navigate Hundred Knight? If Metalia stays locked up in her room, isn't that a problem? Hmm, I wonder. This sounds like a job for... Money! Whoa! Some weird thing just crashed through the window! Oh, Money! What brings you here? A glass window is not an entrance, Master Money. Yikes! Y you're covered in blood! W why is everyone so calm? Ah, yes. This is your first time meeting Master Money, Master Lucini. Master Mani is a rogue fairy. Her outrageousness is comparable to Master Leia. She is far too much of a punk, uh, of a grand individual, to live as other fairies do. This troublesome little fairy is gonna be my master's substitute? Hey now! I was being nice and quiet and listening, so why'd I get such a crappy introduction? I thought you went off on a trip to tour other swamps or something. When Leah's in a pickle, you can bet your booty that the amazing Mani will be there in a flash! Whoosh! Were you... just hanging out at this swamp the whole time? W where's your proof, huh? I was so totally out on my own awesome adventure! But it's all fine now, because I get to support Honey Knight again. I'm as good a navigator as Leah! Then let us leave the support of Sir Hundred Knight to Master Mani. Master Malia should be in Hekahene Forest, beyond her forest garden. Hundred Knight, be sure to find the forest witch. Okay, let's get a move on, Mr. Sir Honey Knight, sir. Let's be an awesome team again. All right, that's a plot twist. I should have known that would happen, though. <laughs> Died a tad bit too early. Otherwise, Malia. Now, let's go inside the house. I want to check if there's anything new here. Bathroom. Oh, 100 Knight. Welcome back. What am I doing? Well, I wanted to get used to this place. So I figured that I would look around a bit. This is what the bath looks like. Water was precious at my hometown, so I've never seen one before. Oh my, Henny Knight, and a little apprentice! What are you two doing here? Can I take a bath together? No! Honestly, I'm not confident about being in water. Pratics makes perfect, you know. Maybe you like dunking yourself in water. Oh, I got it! Why not ask Leah if you can join her next time she takes a bath? She will kill you. <laughs> what? N no way! I could never ask her that! Uh, why? It's not weird for an apprentice to wash their master's back, you know? N no, that's not it. Uh, excuse me, but I have to go. Does he hate being bad things so much that he'd rather run away? Wait, I think I get it now. Leah uses swamp water for her bath, so it's probably dangerous for the little apprentice to hop in. Technically, right? He cannot bath in that, huh? I totally forgot! As for you, Honey Knight, relaxing in the bath is a distant dream. We gotta do what we gotta do, after all. Yeah, if he asks Leah that, she will kill him. 10 seconds flat. Okay, let's go to Hekane Forest. Over here. Ah, 
all the way to this forest. Now. Let's see what will happen. It seems like Metalia isn't going to come out of her room at all. She hasn't eaten anything either. I'm a bit worried. I am very sorry to have worried Master Visco, who has remained here until she may execute Master Leah. Oh, it's not like that I forgot about that or anything. I'm still making my judgement about her as a witch. And how's Hundred Knight? Is it working well with money? As I suggested, it seems to have nearly arrived at the forest garden. Yes. I see. I hope it can meet with the forest witch. Agreed. Master Leah does not have much time left. Huh? What do you mean? You know, I might not mention this tidbit. To you yet, Master Visco? Master Leah's life is nearing its end. Really? Why? Is she sick? I am not aware of any illnesses. It has been predicted by Master Leah herself. Although not even she seems to be aware of the details surrounding it. She knows she's dying soon. But she doesn't know why? Uh oh. Welcome! How can I help you today? Unfortunately, Master Malia is not here. Her absence has stunted the growth of the flowers in the area due to the lack of magic power. Our sole duty is to protect all life that our master Forest Witch Malia had a hand in creating. We can only try to nurture the life she left behind. <laughs> Alucino's twin? Wow, I'm so surprised right now. And of course, our buddy Alucino was right on the money. Uh huh, uh huh, I see. Does it look like the Forest Witch is here? So let's go farther in, just as planned. Oh yeah, Honey Knight. Like Alucino said, Hekahene Forest hasn't been touched by humans, so be extra careful where you step. I bet lots of strong magic beasties live here. <laughs> I'll be getting a tiny bit excited. Okay, let's move! Stage clear. Now, I'm not sure when I, um, I should go and do some exploring on the ways we have missed. Maybe next episode. We'll see. Anyway, let's continue here. Now that we have the new Toshka ability to make us jump. Hekahene Forest. One, three. One. Beautiful music. One. Like usual. One. Yeah. Now I think I might do the same what I did One. for the uh, desert area. Yeah, and just cut oh. when I find something useful. Yeah, I'm not really oh. sure. We get, yeah. Oh, two of them, three of them gives us about 200 XP. That's quite good. And that one gives about 70, damn. Or 68. Okay. 
Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. 150 damage. Damn. That was quite powerful. Okay, this will take a while. Yeah, this will take a while. I'll cast when I beat it. In a sec. Well, welcome back. I finally killed it. That took a damn long time. <laughs> a very long time. Now, I just remembered I got that Toshka skill that makes us able to summon a familiar to outright uh, explore. So why not use that one right now instead? That one was type 10. I no, not the one. That one. Now, let's see. What can we find? Also, I'm, I must not forget about that uh, orb, so that would be embarrassing. Oh, my super enemy. I want to kill that. So here we have that. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We have a key thingy there, or a gate. A gate, I don't know what to call it. Alright, I'll cut them when I get to this area. And I'll kill as many enemies as I can on the way, so in a bit. Well, I'll come back, so yeah. Now I'm here. It seems like I got killed <laughs> by... I met that flower boss, or the stronger boss flower thingy we saw before. And it destroyed me. <laughs> it, it did 200 damage in one hit. <laughs> Damn. I guess I got really surprised by that. So now I have my small army here. Now, let's do it again, what we did before, and I guess we we'll kill these fools first. And use that. Well, it's pissed. Let's see. Now, what do we have? We have these here. Oh, a guardian. Good to know. I can't go through here now. We have a chest up here to the east. West. West. A jumping point here. Damn, I love this Toshka. So much. So we can just go here. All right, so this is, we go west first, then east. Also, I want to distribute grade points. I really need more health. I'm go so going to die otherwise. Just in case. All right, let's go and when I kill, when I get this chest, I'll just cut to when I, wait, what the? I'll cut to when I kill that fool. And green spirit, okay. And nothing else here. Okay, I'll cut to when I kill that thing. So in a bit. I want to see if I can catch him. And... Oh, it did. It worked. Natural incense. Wait, did I just screw myself over right now? 
I hope not. I'll go back and see what happens. Let's see here. If I go up here... So, I, it, it finally respawned. It took a long time. <laughs> I got scared that I could not fight it anymore. Anyway, uh, it seems like... Yeah, it might not be best to kill it. Or absorb it. I had to, at first I just did, or I spawned, got to the, out of the world map, it did not come back, then I went back to the house, and now it has come back. So yeah, I'm not sure what to do, so I'll do some grinding again just to get back my power, so in a bit. Uh, it seems like... He did not leave behind anything. I only got poison moth staff six, so <laughs> I did all that for nothing. <laughs> uh, that's embarrassing. Anyway, uh, I'll see all when I have grinded a bit, and then we can go up. Well, no, um, grinded a bit. So let's go up here. Oh, harpies again. Harpy Henne. Let's do this. See what we can find. Five enemies. Oh, no, no, no. Well, we found <laughs> something at least. Secret contract. Um, I don't know what made it so I cannot do anything. Or uh, what took space. Nice. 33 to 34. I'll con continue exploring, so in a bit. I remembered we are supposed to do, do it like this. <laughs> that one is useless to us. I figured that he has that health bar thingy right there. That's what makes it so he doesn't have a key. As I explore down to the right before and I found the one where I got the gate key from. He did not have any help thing like that. So that was interesting. Nothing here. No. Oh. Wow. Wait, what? Oh my god. I forgot about him. <laughs> Damn, I can't use it. Harpy Henna. Right. Uh oh. Nice. Okay, that's so much. Now, let's see here. 
we can go down there or to that area so what's down here then don't attack me okay can you jump no you can't okay I thought maybe you could jump with that thing. Huh? A station? Oh wow! Looks like a pentagram. Huh? This might be... Let's come back here later, okay, Honey Knight? For now, we need to hurry. Yeah, this looks weird. Wow, well, this game is, is far more massive than I thought. This might lead. Why? Yes, have to. All right, so. Why? Yeah. Why? No, I didn't know. We. Wow. Nothing here. At the next pillar we can end this episode, I think. This is getting a tad bit more than a bargain for once again. Alright. So we have gone more or less a cir full circle here. Right, I'm going to go around and kill everything and get to that. So, in a bit. Now, let's see if we can destroy this. No, I can No! All oh, right, you can. And... Yes! Oh. Mysterious Dark Fragment. Acquired Type 42 Sacerio Toshka. Oh! I think it's. That's what it pronounces. Oh my god! <laughs> I love it! Damn, I love it! <laughs> That's so cool! We got our own cannon fire now. Damn, that's awesome! That's so... I want to, I want to use it again. <laughs> Damn! I did not expect to get something like this. Now, uh, why did we hear that? Uh, okay. A pillar. Don't mind me. 
Uh oh. Green spirit. Oh wow. I don't know what green spirits does. Oh, it's just the green. I never realized. And this leads... Where are we? I'm far over it. And the pillar should be down here somewhere. Judging by the sound. Uh oh. We can end this episode here. So, next time we will continue on and maybe find Amalia. If she is not or hasn't lost her mind now, I will be very surprised. So, thank you for watching and I'll see you all later. Bye bye and take care now. Nice. Everyone, love.